वो इरादा बोलेगा दिल जिस दिन तुम्हें वो दिन जिंदगी का आखिरी दिन होगा इन्होंने एकदम हिमेश श्रेष्ठ सैकल भाई को ऐसे रखकर गाकर सुनाया एक बार जोरदार तालियां सर के लिए नाथ नेक्स्ट वन इज हाउ और एम्ब्रेस बी दिस मोमेंट मे और मे नॉट कम अगैन इन आर लाइफ टाइम हक और एम्ब्रेस मी दिस मोमेंट इन हमारी टीम में जो आंसर आ रहे हैं मुझे लगता है हमारी टीम की तरफ से आ रहे हैं ऐसा लगेगा हम प्री प्लान में और हक और एम्ब्रेस मी दिस ब्यूटीफुल मोमेंट मे और मे नॉट कम अगैन इन आर लाइफ टाइम और ये सर की तरफ से सर गुनगुन गुनाकर आपको बताना है ठीक है लग जा गले के फिर ये हसी शाम फिर गाना तो सर ने सही गेस किया लेडीज को थोड़ा तोड़ मरो के प्रेजेंट किया एक बार जोरदार तालियां सर के लिए एंड नाउ चेंज ऑफ बैन आई थिंक वी आर सो रेडी फॉर दिस इवनिंग अब हम शुरुआत करें उससे पहले मुझे दो चार लोगों से पूछने की आप कितने एक्साइटेड हैं सर आज की शाम को लेकर आप कितने एक्साइटेड हैं बहुत ज्यादा एक्साइटेड है कितने ज्यादा एक्साइटेड है
हम एक ऐसे प्रोडक्ट को लॉन्च करने वाले हैं एक ऐसे प्रोडक्ट के बारे में बात करने वाले हैं जो इंडिया में मैन्युफैक्चर है असेंबल हुए हैं सारे जो पार्ट्स हैं इट्स अ ग्रेट 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 इनिशिएटिव तो एक बार इस इनिशिएटिव के लिए इम्पैक्ट बाय हनीवेल के लिए जोरदार तालियां हो जाए और मुझे लगता है इट्स नॉट जस्ट अ कंपनी इट्स नॉट जस्ट अ ब्रांड बट ईच वन ऑफ यू आपको श्रेय जाता है क्योंकि आज हमें इस ग्रेट मूव का हिस्सा है और यकीन ये शाम बहुत बहुत सारे सरप्राइजेस लेकर आएगी तो चलिए हम बात कर रहे हैं मेक इन इंडिया कॉन्सेप्ट के बारे में और साथ ही हम यहां पर बताना चाहेंगे कि बहुत सारे सरप्राइजेस तो आप तक पहुंचेंगे लेकिन आपको ये बता दू कि लकी ड्रॉ के बारे में आपको मालूम है या नहीं एनी वन आज आपके सपे से मतलब आप सपे से पांच लकी विनर्स होने वाले हैं और पांच लकी विनर्स क्या लकी प्राइजेस लेकर जाएंगे नहीं आइडिया नो आइडिया तो शुरू करें कितने लोग जानना चाहते हैं कि लकी नो विनर्स के लिए क्या क्या प्राइजेस हैं देर ऑन द स्क्रीन सब आ चुके हैं आ चुके हैं ना स्क्रीन पर राइट है सो एवरीबॉडी द फिफ्थ एंड द फोर्थ प्राइज इज
Uh, first of all, thank you everyone for taking the time out and joining us in this very special occasion for the launch of our AIDC products for the Impact family. Um, you all know about Honeywell, of course. Most of you already work with Honeywell, so Honeywell is not a new name. However, you have a new name, you have a new name, you have a new name, which is the Impact brand. So I just wanted to give a little glimpse about what this Impact brand is about. Um, like what she was saying earlier, you know, this whole thing started with the Make in India initiative, which was initiated in India. But before that, traditionally, right, Honeywell used to operate um, by getting products imported into the country and you know, putting our own margin and selling it in India. And that typically ended up us being a player in the premium segment. So we always used to have a good share, a good product <coughs> recognition in the premium segment. Uh, like any other company, we have a lot of growth aspirations. We do want to not just be the number one brand, we want to be the number one in terms of volume share, which is where I think one big hindrance was to be able to target the big mass fit segment, which we were unable to cater to up until now, primarily because we were not manufacturing in India, we were not having the cost advantages which typically a manufacturer in India should ideally have. So, in simple terms, what impact means is made in India animal products for the Indian customers. That's what the Impact brand stands for. Now, one thing that COVID taught everybody was the importance of being self-dependent, which is the whole Atmanibar Bharat. Not just for Bharat, but across the world. Every country now wants to have their own supply chains, right? And more so for an organization like Animal, which really want to de-risk our own supply chains and start looking at countries where we were not present so far in terms of our supply chain network. And that's when we started this whole initiative about two years back with the Impact brand. We started about uh, 2019, November, exactly two years back. 2020, we had grand plans. Uh, of course, COVID spoiled everything. So we had to launch a lot of products which were related to COVID in 2020. So for example, we set up the entire mask manufacturing line in Pune. So we set up the N95 manufacturing and we set up the we are certified mass, which was very much in need last year when every big one suffered. Not just that, we also got into a lot of PPEs which were required by the frontline workers, doctors, nurses, patients, and everybody. So we, we dedicated ourselves in that for 2020. So a lot of making India products were made available in 2020 in the PPE range. In 2021, we shifted gears. We started focusing a lot on software products. We started the year with uh, something called IHP, which is the Integrated Hospital Platform, which is something which is used by hospitals to improve the productivity of doctors, nurses, to improve the turnaround time, give ideas or solutions to improve the revenue generation for hospitals. So that's something we've launched earlier this year. We're working with a lot of hospitals in the country. And that, again, the reason why we focused on that was last year we noticed during COVID that when there was a huge rush into hospitals and doctors were under huge pressure, Every doctor had to see hundreds of patients within an hour's time. So the, the idea was, you know, how do we make this whole thing a little more productive? So that's a, pro that's a solution that's already out there in the market. We also launched something called shipment condition monitoring. Again, an outcome of COVID, <coughs> with the whole vaccine shipment becoming more and more important. It should be transported in a temperature controlled environment. And that's why we came into the picture. We worked very closely with various partners, including the Ministry of Health and Family Affairs, We've launched a blue tag shipment condition monitoring device which is used in monitoring the shipment of vaccines. It basically ensures that your vaccine efficacy is maintained when it's shipped from one location to the other. It's a WHO approved product already being used in the country. Then we shifted gears. Uh, we launched, um, last but not the least, now the AIDC products. Um, I don't know how many of you have heard of EDA51. A mobility device, EDA51. So yeah, so people who've dealt with Honeywell, they all know ED51. ED51 is probably one of the largest selling mobility devices in the world for Honeywell. We started the local manufacturing of ED51 last month in our Pune facility. So that's the first Make in India mobility device that's being manufactured in India. We started with that. In addition to that, we also did a one step ahead and we launched one more SKU which is called the ED51HC, which is called Healthcare which is again very much focused on the healthcare segment. 
again, our focus is a lot on healthcare because there's a lot of requirements in the healthcare segment with regards to digitization. You must have heard a lot of initiatives being driven out by the government of India to digitize the healthcare system. That's where the 51 HC plays a very integral role. And now today we are here to of course launch the barcode printer, um, again completely made in India. Um, and we are really excited to launch this product today. Not just this, um, just also wanted to share our upcoming portfolios. We have next month we'll be launching um, the scanners, both the 1D and the 2D scanners, both completely manufactured in India. And they are all up for display out there. Once the launch is over, you can actually touch and feel these products. We also have plans to launch a low-cost mobility device in uh, quarter two, then another version of Parker printer in quarter three. So that's some all the plans that we have for uh, 2022. Um, that said, um, I, I just want to say that this is not just a Honeywell product. This is an India product. 